So if you're homeless and you're looking for a non-profit organization that can help you. I have a dream, that's all I need. I'll make it happen with some work and belief. The thing is, if you look at the question, the question is non-profit organization to help homeless people. I'm going to talk about this the thing is, it's not really a question. It's more like a person is looking for a non-profit organization to help homeless people or a homeless person is in the library and he's looking for non-profit organization that may or may not help that person right so technically we have two situation if you are homeless you are looking for a non-profit organization that can help you or you are a person or company that's looking for a non-profit organization that can help you so Let's put here in company and you're looking for a non-profit organization. The thing is, when you look at non-profit organization, there's a couple of things that you need to keep in mind. And one of them is you need to make sure that you look at the goal of the non-profit organization, especially if you are someone that wants to donate to a non-profit organization that helps homeless people. The reason why I'm saying that is because try to keep in mind that when you talk about non-profit organization keep the word organization in mind organization they have cost and if organization is not running well if you donate to help homeless people that doesn't mean your money is going to donate um, to help homeless people let me give you an example um, i'm not saying they are doing that i'm not um, saying they are doing something wrong i'm just saying think about it yeah when you have a big organization like a big non-profit organization if it's big they have a lot of cost and when you donate to them you the money will not go directly to the cause of the non-profit organization the money will go to the organization that doesn't mean the money will go to help those people you understand so when you have a non-profit organization yes it's a non-profit organization but it's an organization they have cost if they don't have a suitable business model that means they need to find a way to cover the cost and most of the time it's donation i'm not saying they are not doing their work i'm not saying they are using the money just to run their organization i'm just saying think about it and if you look at a lot of non-profit organization they all depends on donation yes they depend on donation why they need to pay the cost after they cost, they're going to help the people. Why Why will they pay the cost first? Because if they do not pay the cost, the company cannot run. You understand what I mean? So it's technically really simple. You have income and you have cost. If there's no money coming in, then you have a problem. So here, if there is no money coming in, you have a problem. If money come in, so you need to cover the cost and then you can help people. It's not like when someone donates something that money goes directly to the cost. No, it doesn't work like that. They pay their cost first and then it goes to the other people. Or they pay the cost to organize everything in order to help those people. So again, it will go to the cost. I'm not talking bad about non-profit organization. But what I'm saying is, think about it. If you have a non-profit organization, make sure you have a proper business model. So if you are someone that has a lot of money or you have some money aside and you are thinking about donating to a non-profit organization, donate to a big one that has a big brand, it's fine. But the money will just go to the brand and the cost of the organization. You can use that. For your personal gain like hey i donated to that organization i support them yes it can help you a lot but if you really well help some someone out most of the time you should just look at the organization and see what their activities are and if you look at these activities think about it. okay what are they really doing are they really making a change for example if one is building a school in an undeveloped uh, country and 
the children go to school and they get some books and stuff you're seeing some changes but as soon as you pay that nonprofit organization they pay for the cost of the school but the money doesn't go directly to the cause you understand what i mean so that's what you need to keep in mind okay if you're looking for nonprofit organization that helps you can google them but most of the time if you google if you google nonprofit organization try to google it um, on the google map when you look at google maps you can profit um you can type nonprofit organization and then homeless people and you will see a lot of nonprofit organization i'm not sure if you go find a um, red cross or something but um that's how you find them in order to um, support them some non-profit organization it's worth it to invest in them or to support them some don't so keep that in mind so that's why you see a lot of big companies when they are trying to um support some non-profit organization they're going to look at the non-profit organization and see where's the money going to some of them don't care they just put they just want to label like hey i support this organization and what you sometimes see a lot is a lot of big companies support local non-profit organization like non-profit organization that helps um, children go to school in the local community that's nice because you see the difference directly so if you want to support something and you want to see where your money is going to look at your local community and look at non-profit organization that suits your interests otherwise don't yeah i'm not say talking bad about non-profit organization but if you have an organization and you're only relying on donation there's something wrong try to think about a good business model that can help you non-profit organization i will say this a lot during my live stream and my videos because i see a lot of non-profit organization they don't have a proper business model so if you're homeless and you're looking for a non-profit organization that can help you look for it you can google it or talk with people in your community and they can help you to find one there should be one it's not difficult to find one thing is when you find one they have rules if they have rules try to keep it if you don't like the rules look for another there will be a lot i'm not saying that there are a lot of non-profit organizations for homeless people but do not only look for homeless look for other um non-profit organization because they can help you with other things and maybe they can help with getting a job and then you can buy your home or rent a place and then you're not homeless anymore it seems like i'm talking i'm saying like it's easy it's not and i am not saying i understand how you feel um, when you're looking at this video if you're homeless but you you are at the bottom you can just go up from now so just look for some of them if it doesn't meet your interest look for another one yeah so if you have question about non-profit organization that you look to or you have a non-profit organization where you think okay i do not trust them or i do not know what to do with him and or you have other question just go to the link in the description and you can press the law center you can join the community and then uh, you can ask me question directly if you want some free advice during the legal session you can get um, free advice so you press here you go into community and then when there is a free legal session i will help you with the, your question and if you really like this video or the stream eh, and you want to support me just buy me some coffee i have a dream that's all i need i'll make it up with some work and believe know what i want so i'll take it on I made mistakes, but mistakes make you strong. Let's break it down for a minute. I want the crown, I'm gon' get it. You hear me loud, man, I'm winning. Yeah, Charlie Sheen will be.